Hello, welcome, welcome. How are you doing tonight? Hello, Asensio. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Good evening. How are you doing today? Are you ready? Hello, Carlos. Welcome. How are you? Hello, Carlos. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you? Um, I'm tired, teacher. Really? Why? <laughs> okay. Why are you tired? Um, the world today is is most in, in the office. Oh, really? How many hours? Um. Uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, how many hours did you work? Okay. Um. Um. I am. Um, I, I. I agree. Agree. Um. Ah. Oh, okay. 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 Um. Uh, seven. Seven hours. Wow. And uh, where do you work? I work in. I work in uh, agri at uh, the agri in public accounting, mm -hmm. uh, um, auditing in, in business business, um, is auditing um financial, um fiscal. I don't know. It's is is Spanish or English fiscal. Okay, okay. In, uh, fiscal, uh, fiscal. Yes, um uh, verify verify um uh, tax and cum uh cumplan or cumplimiento. Uh comply. Comply, yes. Uh, yeah. Order order other uh only that. <laughs> nice, nice, very good. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you for sharing. Okay, teacher. Thank you. All right. Uh, hello, Arsenio. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, sir. I'm fine. How was your day? It's really quiet. Really? Why? Yes. Why was it quiet? I have not um very very work. Oh, you didn't have a lot of work. Where do you work? At the office. I work in computer system. Oh, really? And what does the functions of computer systems? What are the functions? The really, I. Very, I take the, the statistic. Oh, the statistic. statistics. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Arsenio, for your participation. Elmer, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. Are you ready for your English class? Yes. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, can you tell me a little bit about what you remember from yesterday's class? What do you remember from yesterday's class? Mm, yesterday, I remember um, we talked about present perfect mm -hmm. and present perfect continuous. That's correct. And, and, can we you give me an example work. in the present perfect? Present perfect. Um, One example. I have um, clean up, clean up, 
the clean. house. I have cleaned the house. Very good. I have cleaned the house. I have cleaned. Okay. And can you give me an example using the present perfect continuous? The me, teacher. Okay. I have bought a new car. I have bought, bought a new car. A new car. Okay. Excellent. Car. That is present perfect. Who can give me an example with present perfect continuous? Me, teacher. Yes, Elmer. I have been finished uh, the, the homework. Okay, I have been finishing. Fin finishing my homework. Very good. Excellent. Another example with the present perfect continuous. Another example with the present perfect continuous. Me teacher. Yes, Carlos. I have been reading my bicycle. I have been Riding. Riding, yes. My bicycle. Excellent. Okay. All right. Those are just a couple of examples of the passive voice. Now, who can tell me some examples using the, the connectors? Do you remember the connectors? Teacher. Huh? Yes. Okay. Can you give me one example, please? For example, if I say to you, well, let's look at the video. Let's look at the video and then we're going to do some examples. Ready, let's listen. Nevertheless, you have studied a lot. It is important to keep on learning. So get ready to connect ideas. Connecting, Connecting ideas, ideas. okay. Who can give me a sentence or one example uh, with additionally? Additionally, one sentence using additionally. One example. Connecting uh, ideas. Maybe, maybe teacher, uh, I work in the office mm -hmm. and additionally, I work in the house. Okay, very good, very good. Excellent example. You can say, I am employed in a company and additionally, I have a home-based business, right? I am employed in a company, and additionally, I have a home-based business. Good example, good example. Can somebody else give me another example, please? Another example, please. 
with additionally. Somebody else. Me, me teacher. Any? Okay. Um, I donated money for the library. Additionally, I donated some books. Very good. I donated money for the library. And uh, additionally, I donated books. Perfect. Okay. Um, who can give me an example using as a result? As a result. Who can give me an example using as a result? Anybody? Okay. Let's do an example with as a result. Me, did you? Okay, Sergio. Um, like um, in summer is warm, and as a result, the flowers grew a lot. Okay, in the summer, it's warm. As a result, many flowers blossom. Excellent. Good example. Anybody else have another example? Anybody else have another example? Somebody, give me an example, please. Anybody? Okay, maybe if I say to you, um, the country is safe, as a result, many foreign investors are uh, tr attracted to El Salvador, right? The country is safe as a result. Many foreign investors are attracted to El Salvador. Who can give me another example? Who can give me another example? Anybody? Nobody? Okay. I'll try. All right, Elizabeth, go ahead. The, the team in train very hard as result the win the champion. <laughs> Oh, the champion. The one. Very good. All right. The team trained very hard. As a result, they won the championship. They won the championship. Perfect. All right. 
Uh, let's look at the following one. Let's look at the next one. Let's look at, um, we already finished, Oops. we already did, we did um, additionally as a result, for example, okay, for example, who can give me a sentence using for example? One sentence using for example. Give me one example. Somebody? Okay. I can say, I love Salvadorian food. For example, Excuse me. Oh, you. Just the air conditioner. Give me one moment. Okay. So we say, I love Salvadorian food. For example, pupusas. Can somebody give me an example? Can anybody me give me? All right, go ahead. I like animals. For example, cats and parrots. Very good. I like animals. For example, cats. And parrots. Good. All right. Can somebody give me one more example? One more example. Um, I I try. Okay. I enjoy to read the story books, history books. For example, uh, Robin Hood. Okay, excellent. Uh, I enjoy reading history books. For example, Robin Hood. Perfect. Okay. All right. Let's go for the next one. We're going to look at for instance. For instance. Who can give me an example with for instance? One example using for instance. One example. Anybody? One example. For instance. So we already did additionally as a result, for example, now we are going to do 
for instance. Who can give me an example? Anybody? You can say, for example, I love hamburgers for instance, um, Burger King. Can somebody give me another example? Somebody give me one more example. Anybody? Me, teacher. Carlos. <clears throat> okay. Um, I like chicken. I like chicken. chicken. Yeah. For some for for stains. For um, instance, uh -huh. Kentucky, KFC, K KFC, KFC, yes. good, 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 okay, good job, Carlos, okay, teacher, very good, thank you, another volunteer, another example, another volunteer, another example, Somebody. Um, I. Elizabeth. I like vegetables. I like Sorry. vegetables. Uh -huh. For instance, the. Cucumber. Cucumber. Thank you. Very good. Okay. All right, guys. So uh, this is a little review in regards to the activity from yesterday's class. At this moment, do you have any questions about this exercise? Any Mr. questions? Yes. What is the difference? The for example, and for instance. The same, it's the same thing. There's no difference. It is exactly the same thing. Okay, thank you, sir. Yes. Another question. Another question. Nobody? Questions, questions? Somebody, somebody? No question, teacher. Okay. Now, what I would like for us to do is let's finish the video. Additionally, as a result, for example, for instance, furthermore, indeed, in fact, likewise, nevertheless, on the other hand, similarly, therefore. Look at the following expressions. Can you connect ideas using them? Type them on a discussion box. All right, let's look at this. If you ask me the way I see it, disagreeing, that may be true but I see your point, but giving reasons. That's why the reason for that is, okay, let's start with the first one. If you ask me the way I see it, I can say, 
if you ask me el salvador is the most beautiful country in the world the way I see it, El Salvador is rich in tropical fruit. Okay, these are just some examples for you to have an idea. Let me share it with you here. Who can give me an example? Who can give me an original example? If you ask me the way I see it, who can give me one example? Me teacher. Carlos. <clears throat> okay. Yes. Is you ask, ask me mm -hmm. the summer beautiful the world? Very good. If you ask me the summer. Oh uh, no, 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 no. The 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 um beach the beach the beach the, the beach El Salvador or El Salvador uh, the beach, I don't know. Or you could say, if you ask me, El Salvador's the beach beaches beautiful the world are the oh. most beautiful in the world. world. Yes. Very good. Okay, good, good. Or you can say the way I see it, El Salvador's beaches are the best in the world. You can say it both ways. Both ways are acceptable. Okay. Okay, guys, any questions about this activity? Questions about this activity? Anybody? No questions? Okay. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to look at these questions over here. We're going to look at knowledge check. 3.8, knowledge check, 3.8, instructions, circle the appropriate connector to complete the sentences. Tom loves technology. He has the latest cell phones. Similarly, for example, all right, I would like for you to work with a partner and do the activity together. And then when you finish, we will check as a class. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. okay. All right, yes, let's, do teacher. Teacher. let's do it. Work in pairs.
Do you see? Yes, yes. Okay. Um, okay. The first is some loves technology uh, options similarly, or for example, he has the last cell phone. Maybe some love technology, for example, he has the latest cell phone. For, for example. What? For example, okay. Yes. And number two, many cities have whistlers, hot spots, spots, never, nevertheless. Never interesting. In fact, others don't. Okay. So, um, I never uh, never I in number mm -hmm. three. In number three, most students do research online now. Internet access is library libraries is necessary. Therefore, therefore, therefore. some website websites aren't reliable. Many people are being misinformed. Misinformed. As a result. As a result. And the internet change fast. Is it really? <laughs> so do cell phone. For example, or likewise. What does likewise? Likewise. Likewise. Uh, likewise. Blocks cover everything. They are updated frequently. Oh. The blocks cover. Okay. On the other hand, they put their more. Congratulations! Good job. <laughs> yes, good job. Okay, another. Ah, good. Siguiente. Negro. Ah, de seguro que se nos va a venir. Hay un list. All right, let me have the first volunteer. Let me have the first volunteer read number one. Read number one, the first volunteer. Number one. One volunteer. Number one. Who wants to read it? First one. Who wants to read the first one? Number one as well, for example. Juan Eduardo, excellent. Number one. Tom loves technology. For example, he has the latter cell phone. Very good. So your answer is, for example. Good job. Number two, one volunteer. Number two. Hi, teacher. Okay. 
Many cities have wireless hub spots. Never, never, nevertheless. Nevertheless. Uh -huh. Others don't. Others don't. Good job. Good job. Thank you. Number three. Number three. Me, teacher. Yes, Sergio. Most students do research online now. Therefore, internet access in libraries is a necessity. Excellent. Correct. Number four. Number four. <clears throat> Me, teacher. Carlos. Okay, uh, number four. Some websites are really reliable. As, reliable. As a result, many people are being misinformed. As a result, many people are being misinformed. Very good. Misinformed. Misinformed. Very good. Number five, another volunteer. Number five, another volunteer. Hi, teacher. Yes, Elizabeth. The internet changed fast. Likewise, so do cell phones. Excellent. Likewise, so do cell phones. Very good. Uh, number six, the last one. The last one. One volunteer. The last one. One volunteer. Somebody. Me, teacher. Sergio. Blogs cover everything. Furthermore, they are updated frequently. Excellent. All right. So we got furthermore, likewise, as a result, therefore, nevertheless, for example. Good job. Any questions? Any questions? Questions, questions. Somebody, no anybody. Question. Okay, all right. Well, let's go ahead and take a look at the next section. For the next section, we're going to be looking at section 3.9, Lesson Objectives. By the end of this class, participants will know how to use negative and tag questions to give opinions. negative and tag questions for giving opinions. Listen and repeat. That was a great restaurant, wasn't it? Listen and repeat. That was a great restaurant, wasn't it? That was a great restaurant. Great restaurant. Was it is. Right. So the, the last the last part is emphasis up, wasn't it? Wasn't it? That's right. Wasn't it? Wasn't it? That's right. Uh, repeat. The post office is next to the bank, isn't it? The post office is next to the bank. Isn't it? Isn't it? The post office is next to the bank, isn't it? The post office is next to the bank, isn't it? The post the office, office, the office isn't next to the bank, is it? The post, the post office, office, the post office, office is, is the bank. Is it next to the bank? Is it, is, it, is, it, is it? The post office isn't next to the bank. Is it? The, the post, post office, office isn't, isn't next, next to the bank. Next to bank. 
Is it? it? Is okay. It? Let's watch the video. Let's watch the video. Don't you think learning English is easy? Let's go over negative and tough questions for giving opinion. Negative and tough questions for giving opinions. Use negative questions or tough questions to offer an opinion and invite someone to react. Isn't it weird how some people are always on their cell phones? Doesn't it seem like kids spend too much time in front of the TV? Wouldn't it be great if everyone had a cell phone like that? Shouldn't the government limit the number of sites? I get email on my cell phone. That's nice, isn't it? TV makes kids lazy, doesn't it? Use the phrase, don't you think, to form negative or tough questions. Don't you think there are too many websites? It's actually dangerous, don't you think? Negative and tough questions for giving opinions. A tough question is a question added at the end of the sentence. Tough questions are used to make sure there is agreement with one's opinion or to make sure information is correct. That was a great restaurant, wasn't it? The post office is next to the bank, isn't it? The post office isn't next to the bank, is it? The verb in the tough question is negative if the first verb in the sentence is affirmative, and affirmative if the first verb is negative. Tough questions have falling intonation when the speaker expects the listeners to agree. They have rising intonation when the speaker wants to express uncertainty. Negative questions are also used to seek agreement with an opinion. Read the following vowels. Agree or disagree with these opinions. Look at, let's look at the first one right here. Millions of people are addicted to the internet these days. It's kind of, it's kind of strange, isn't it? Wouldn't it be great if they could eliminate all spam from email? Won't you find it almost, don't you find it almost impossible to avoid pop-up ads? Shouldn't the government limit the types of websites allowed on the internet? Don't you think a lot of people are being confused by misinformation on the internet? All right, so for this exercise, what you are going to do is you are going to come over here in the discussion box and you're going to put negative and tag question for giving opinion. And here you are going to express your opinion. For example, uh, let's see. Millions of people are addicted to the internet these days. It's kind of strange, isn't it? Okay, so I can say, for example, um, in my opinion, I do think it's strange that everyone is always on their cell phones when I was a young man. We did not have cell phones. 
we used to play kickball or or cops and robbers in my neighborhood. All right. I want you to give me at least four examples. And then when you finish, I want you to send it to the discussion forum. One opinion for each one. One, two, three, four, five. One opinion. Any questions? Any questions? Questions, questions. Somebody, does anybody have a question? Somebody have a question? Anybody? Anybody? Elizabeth, no questions? No, teacher. Okay. All clear. All clear? Okay, let's go ahead and do it. And then we will check together as a class. The last, the, donde dice, it's kind of strange, isn't it? Then the first question is, no tengo bien la pantalla. Do you read? Excuse the, 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 the video, eh? Yes. Okay. Ah, ahí está. Es, ya la puso el picho. Oh, thank you so much. Okay. O oh, quién está compartiendo, no sé. Ah, Elmer lo está compartiendo. Elmer, sí. Elmer. Hi, Elmer. Bueno. No listen. Sí, <laughs> para... the microphone off. Hi. Oh, sorry. Yes. <laughs> no problem, eh, Okay, thanks. Okay, eh, eh, yo entendía que de, del, del video era que teníamos que leer esas preguntas y decir si estamos en de acuerdo o en desacuerdo. Así entendía yo, disagree uh, on Ingrid. Yes. Pero el teacher puso esas oraciones que puso ahí en el, en el, en el chat o en el discussion. Y esas, esas oraciones no entendí porque, la, o sea, cuál era el objetivo de, cuando él las puso. O era él estaba dando respuesta a cada una. Yo entendí que solo la, a la primera, a esta, a Miriam. Ah, solo a, a esa, ¿verdad? 
Yes. So in my opinion, is I don't think it's stronger that everyone is always always on their cell phones. When I was young man, we didn't cell phone. We used to play kid ball. Ahí que eso es lo que me perdí ahí, no sé qué era lo que quería que, que hicieran. It's very long, it's very long, long, long answer. In my opinion, I do think. I understand, I don't understand. <laughs> yes, and uh, for me, in, in the opinion, that shouldn't the government limit the stage of the website, mm -hmm. uh, along with or the internet, and in my opinion, um, it's necessary the lim the the government um made the law law for the limited the uh, of website because the the internet is 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 necessary, but in this this place, how many information bad bad information and good information? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um. Are right in the chat, Elmer. The answer. The answer. Uh, I I try, but um... <laughs> in the chat, I, I... <laughs> <Here. laughs> please. My 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 grammar is not so it's good. Bad. <laughs> it's, it's bad. No problem. No problem. No problem. <laughs> We say <laughs> okay, I try. Okay, I try. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, the chat in the grab. The, the the chat room. Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. Okay, okay. Yes, yes. No, no, no platform. Here. Okay, okay. In my opinion. Another or, or um, opinion, the answer. No, Elizabeth. Mm, I. <laughs> Solamente que esta, esta en, en este chat, si yo lo envío, es para todos. No, en este, en este chat aquí, donde aparece abajito. Solo vemos nosotros. Ah, estaba escribiendo, estaba escribiendo y me aparece a todos. Y, y todos los, 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 los ejemplos que ha dado el teacher. <risa> no, pero en, en este solo estamos nosotros. Le voy a mandar uno yo. Hi. Y ahí va a ver okay. que solo, es, solo nos cae a nosotros. Cuatro. 
Mm, va, está bien, voy a intentar entonces. Aunque ya lo tengo que escribir aquí, pero no sé. Bye. ¿Y qué? Maybe no people at the internet these days is crazy. Lo, lo logran ver. Um, yes. In my opinion, it's necessary. The government make law the limit the wife's that website. The the website website because because in this place have a good good information. It's good opinion. I try. <laughs> My grammar is not very good. Yeah. Good job, Elmer. Good job. Good job. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> My grammar is bad. It's bad. Good okay. job, Elmer. Good size. In the wouldn't it be great if they could eliminate all spam from email? Um, it's a good idea, but it's difficult. Mm -hmm. Because um the the hacker mm -hmm. is very very um, good technology. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. They have a good technology. Yes. And the program um the pro the program pro programmation, I don't know it's in English pro programmer. It's good. Um, the hacker. Yes. Uh, uh, robar, ¿cómo se dice en inglés? Roban. Ya nos Steel. vamos a sacar el... Ya nos vamos Steel. a sacar ahorita. All right, guys. Time's up. Time's up. Time's up. <laughs> I will see you guys on Monday. Please continue to work on the platform. If okay, you have any teacher. questions, please ask me some questions. No class tomorrow, teacher. Uh, tomorrow is Friday. Okay. Excuse uh, me, teacher. What is your uh, full name? It's necessary uh, to complete survey. Uh, yes. Uh, let me let me send it to you right now.
There's a lot of teachers I, right there. I see Monday the class teacher. All right. See you on Monday. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right. Thank good you, night. Good night, guys. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye. Good night. Thank you, guys. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good evening. Bye-bye. Monday. See you Monday.